What is going on guys? Welcome back to some more Days Gone. This is episode number 25. I hope you guys are enjoying this series so far, man. Thank you so much for your support. Without further ado, let's dive in, man. We need to work with Ricky about Boozer's arm. I have no idea what we're going to be doing, but let's dive in. Let's see what is good, and let's continue on with the story. We're going to go ahead and see Ricky, though. Um, the last episode was pretty insane. Like We just scraped past the horde, and uh, yeah, man, it, was, it wasn't good hey, Ricky, at I, all. Ricky, uh, I got a favor to ask. Yeah, what's up, Deke? Um... It's about Boozer's arm. Uh, I saw that hook that you made for him, and uh, it's great, but uh, don't you think it might be better if, instead of a hook, I don't know, maybe with something like a knife or a blade or something, you know? Uh, oh, oh, hold on. Oh, please, thank you. So, oh. if it oh, I'm sorry about that. So, uh, you, you want me to, you want me to create a prosthetic blade? For Boozer? Well, yeah, I just thought I might cheer him up, make him feel, you know, more of a. You want me to weaponize Boozer? Well, would it, <laughs> weaponize? Would it <laughs> I'm just fucking with you, Deke. I think uh, it's a great idea. Uh, I will go check some parts and I will radio what I need. Cool? Okay. Okay. Uh... <laughs> it's. <laughs> I love their like relationship they've got. I, I really like Ricky. She's a good character. Um, okay, wait for Ricky's call. Okay. Okay. So how and when is she gonna call? And that boosts his arm. Okay. So I guess we could go for a sleep or something. I don't really know. How this works. Shit like this is weird. Um, I, I don't really know. Okay. So I'm gonna wait for her to call, and I will see you guys in a second. Okay, so we have the call, and um, we have what we need. We need a blade, some metal, and some scrap. Jesus, Ricky. Metal tube, metal tube. Can't just be any metal tube, can it? Gotta find one from a construction site. Ah, oh, shit, okay. Wait, 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 hold on a second. There was a house um, under construction at Marion Forks, but I can find something there. Okay, so where are we going, man? We are going, what the fuck? Are you kidding me? Okay, okay, let's get over there. Let's get over to O'Leary Mountain. Let's get there, we're going to fuel up, and then we're going to continue on. Freaking crazy so far, man. Jesus, that is a lot of travelling. So yeah, let's get there, and I'll see you guys in a second. Okay, so a lot of travelling has been done. We are almost there, let's rock and roll. And uh, hopefully, things are smooth. Whoa, okay, whoa, shit, there's zombies here. Okay, okay, fucker, let's go. Adios. Okay, there's more. Oh, he's not dead? Fuck, I thought I killed him. Okay, you know what? You know what, motherfucker? This is how I know we're not ready for a swarm, because we're taking on, like, two, and uh, we're struggling. <laughs> okay, can we move you? Move you back a bit. We need to push all these cars through so we're able to drive through here with our bike. Oh, that might be good. Okay, we actually knocked our bike over because I'm a doofus. Let's go. Okay, let's wheel it back. Forward a little. Have I ever been through this tunnel? I don't think I might have. Um, seeing that all the stuff is like blocked up in there. I was kind of worried that there's like zombies or, or like marauders or something trying to like ambush me or whatever when I move the stuff. But I guess we're okay. I guess we're okay. Let's go. There's another Nero site there. Should I do it? Or is that the one we've already done? Let me just double check, because I have no idea. It isn't. We do get some upgrades for it. You know what? Let's go. Let's go and do it, man, just in case. Uh, we probably will need it as well. Um, I'm going to get the MG out, because that is probably the quickest way to dispatch these motherfuckers. Um, okay, I wonder Here if I is. could perhaps take down the things first. Okay, false fuse panels, okay. Okay. Oh, God damn it. Fuse blown. Are we good? Oh, where the hell am I gonna get a fuse? Okay. Anything lying around over here? No. Alrighty. I guess we can't just walk in there. I mean, that would be way too easy. This is it. What is it? Okay, it's in here somewhere. Just get in here. There we go. Alright. 
Where? Come on. Gotcha. Okay. Maybe over at this like little bus thing or whatever the hell it is. No, maybe not. I, I don't even know what we're doing, man. Ah, there we go. Nice. <laughs> yes. Okay, I've got the fuse. Okay, so I'm not going to do that yet. I, what I want to try and do is get up here and disable the speakers. Because obviously they are going to hear the speakers and come for me. So I'm going to try and disable as many of these fuckers as I can before the alarm goes off. I think that's a good idea. Let's go. Nice. There's one. There's two. I don't know if I see any more. I think they're all wired up, though. Um, so we could just look around for the wire to see if there's any more. Okay, there's one more down there. Let's go ahead and do this now, because later on, these motherfuckers won't be able to hear me. So, might be worth doing. Now, after we do this, I want to see if there's any more laying around. I also want to give myself a quick little heal. Okay, so to here, apparently, oh shit, is there one way up there? I think there might be one more up here. Still though, if we take them all out, it should make things very, very quiet. And we should just be able to walk in there and grab the shit. In theory. We'll see how that goes, but let's go. So this will upgrade our stamina or our health. I think I'm going to go for stamina. Let's go. We good? Off figures. Okay. Oh shit, I forgot about that. Does it need gas? Nope, I think we're good. Out of gas. Fuck. Of okay, we need gas. Where the fuck is the gas? Usually this place does have gas just chilling around, uh, so we can just pour it in. Um, we've got to find some though. Is there any in here? There's like gas under there. I don't think I can get it. Damn it. Okay, they're exploding barrels. That's not gas. Come on. I'm going to find some because I'm a douche. And uh, I'll, f I'll get back to this in a second. Aha. We have gas, baby. We got some gas. Let's, let's power up this motherfucker. Let's get the hell out of here. Okay. So hopefully we've clipped all the alarms. I kind of hope so. Let's go. Come on. Nice. Now can we open you? Oh, no, of course we can't. We've got to turn it on. I'm a dick. Wait, I'm, not, I'm an idiot. I'm an absolute idiot. We've got to turn it on by this button here. Let's go. Alright, nice. Slam that button, Deke. Yeah, now we're in business. And there's no alarm. We can just walks on okay. in. Let's see what we got. Carefree. Here. Grab the upgrades. Where they at? There we go. So I'm going to go for stamina. I think uh, we went for health last time. I'm going to go for stamina this time. Uh, let's go. Stamina. Let's go. Kaboom. Nice. There we go. We got that complete as well. Nice. Now, I don't think there's anything else really here. Just a gun locker. So, we're going to continue on down the road. I don't think we got far to go either. So, I'm just going to keep it going. We're going to keep on rocking. And, uh, yeah, man. Let's see. We've got some zombies ro uh, roaming in. Oh, that's one of them screaming bitches. Oh, nice. I'm glad we killed her, man. Because she is loud as fuck. A screamer. There we go. Let's rock and roll, man. Let's get out of here. Them zombies were terrifying. I can't remember. Yeah, it was called a screamer. Absolutely terrifying. Okay, so I think we're getting near the area. Shit, that's right. I gotta finish burning out these nests. This place is infested, though. We can't. Oh, I remember this place. Because the bridge was out. We went here when uh, we were trying to get Lisa. I believe. Nest. When we fought the bear. Gotta be right around here. Okay, there's so many nests. There's so many everything. I don't know where we're going. Okay, we're going down like the far end of town, which is nice, away from all the nests and shit. That is good. I guess I'll come back here and finish burning metal too. Okay, Burn. let's go. Metal tube. Can I move? The fuck? Let's get my guns up in here, man. I don't know what the fuck is chilling in here. Okay, metal tube. Let's go. We've got some kerosene. Oh, we didn't even get kerosene. It was a bandage. How did I even get that mixed up? Okay. Can we get up or something? Ah, here, here we, we go. go. Nice. Oh, that'll do it. Find the hunting blade. That is what's up next. Okay. 
Where are we looking for that? Don't tell me. Okay, it's in the same area, which is nice. Got to make sure we keep hold of the bike, just because shit could get bad, man. Okay, hunting blade. Let's go. Let's go. Now, this place is infested. I've got to be careful here, man. Oh, shit. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Nice. Nice again. And you just sit there. That's it. Good idea. Oh, fuck. Dude. Nice. <laughs> they just sit there. What the fuck? Look, what's their what's their deal, man? I don't even know. We need to reload. Here okay, so is. we need to get into this store. Now, just get through here. Blade. Please don't be a nest. You gotta take a closer look. Yeah. Which way? There you are. Alright. The hell? Easy. Ah, uh, here we go. Right. Oh, what the fuck? You're mine now. Okay. Oh, shit, get out of here. Is he the one that had it? I think he was. Okay. Another nest. Let's go. Cool. Nest in here. God damn it. What the fuck is that? Oh boy. You know what? We're here. We might as well. We a little one, but still. They're just as bad, I guess. Oh, just as bad. Okay. Nice. 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 There we go. Okay, where the fuck is this blade? I thought this little shit had it. Oh, there it is. I'm a douche. There we go. We got it. Okay. Bring the parts to Ricky. Is that it? Seriously? That's all we need to do now. Motherfucker. Who are these people? Crap. Somebody's trapped. They gotta help. Okay. Let's go. Help! Help! I need help! What? You're gonna be okay. You wanna die out here? Jeez. Look, there's a camp in I'll go. Where? Show me. Show me. Um, Hot Springs, Iron Mike's, or Lost Lake, or oh, Hot or oh, Copeland. Sorry. Let's go. Let's go with Iron Mike's. Head to Lost let's Lake. Let's go. Ask for Ricky Patel. Bro, we just got a shit ton of trust you. for that. Thank you so much for stopping. I was so dead. I was never getting out of there. Thank you. Okay. Yeah. Let them know it was Deacon St. John. They know me. Okay. Keep running. Stay out of sight. Alrighty, so there's a gas station here. I don't think we're going to be able to fast travel on the current gas that we have because we need to go all the way back down to the Lost Lake, um, which is terrible. That is absolutely terrible. Um, I don't think we can travel. Nope, we can't travel there as well. I think what we need to do, we can't travel from where we're at because there is so many infestations. So what we're going to do through the power of editing, because uh, obviously that is probably the best power to have when you're doing YouTube videos, uh, can I just fuel up and then I'll get down now. We'll see you guys in a second when we come back with the parts for Boozer's Arm. Okay, so we have got the supplies and we're back at Lost Lake. Let's see what is good. Uh, hopefully we can make him some kind of super weapon hanging off his arm. But let's go and see what Ricky is going to conjure up. Whoa, the frames. Jeez. Okay, we're here. Well, let's go. Let's hop off the bike. It was a little bit of a travel. I'm not going to lie, but it is all good. We are here now with the supplies. Let's make Boozer a freaking super weapon. Can we just strap a machine gun to his arm or something? That'd be crazy. Hey. hey. I got those parts that you asked for. Oh, great. Well, uh, check back in a few. I'll see what I can do, yeah? Uh, Ricky. Thanks. Yeah. Boozer's one of us now. Hey. Nice. Okay, we all good there, baby. Let's go. So she's going to make him some kind of super weapon on his arm. I think it's going to be like a knife or some shit. Okay, about Boozer's arm, mission complete. Iron Mike's is starting to like us a lot more. Surviving isn't living. Uh, Boozer will survive. Now we need a reason to live. Okay, so we've got a new skill point. We might as well chuck that on while we are here. I don't even know what to use. We've got level 5 on the range stuff. Um, 
Increases projectile penetration. That might be quite nice. Um, headshot kills recover health. We're going to go with that. All three of them, max ones, are probably very, very good. And uh, we probably need all of them. But yeah. Um, okay, what do we do now? I don't think we've got anything to do. Unless something wants to pop up in a second. Usually it don't, because uh, this is days gone. I'm actually going to go and sell some bounties while we're here. Um, let's deal with this. Probably not a lot there. No, not much. Got. Nearly got level yeah. uh, level two trust with our mics, which is pretty cool. Um, I don't really know what we can do now, though. It's kind of weird. I do hate this bit about Days Gone when we're kind of waiting around to find out what to do. Um, we don't really have much. We have the ripped parts. We have the infestations. There isn't much to do. Um, and talk to Rookie. Uh, rookie, Rookie. Okay, I guess we could do that. I don't really know. I don't think there's anything else we can really do. So we might as well go and check Deep. this mission out Group while we're here. Shot up the gate, and when we wouldn't let him in, they rode off. Okay. Ah, shit. Which direction? Uh, they headed west, but they didn't go far. They set up camp just north of Eden Hill. Okay. I think they might be planning another attack, so I need you to take a look. <sighs> okay. Right. Yeah, I'll handle it. Let's go. Thanks, Deke. Let's go. Okay. Drifters at Eden Hill. We're going to do this mission. Why the hell not? They're not that far. Well, let's go. Let's get on the bike. Let's get rocking. And let's take these motherfuckers out. Let's go. So we are in a bit of a pickle if we do get shot off our bike because we don't have any scrap to be able to repair it. So hopefully the bike ends up in one piece at the end of this mission. Probably not the way I'm driving it. We actually need more fuel as well. Shit. I didn't know he was that low. God damn. Okay. Right, can we just speed this up? Is there any way we can speed this up? Probably turning the bike around is a good idea. We need to go and visit the mechanics once more just to get fueled up and everything. So let's, uh, let's go. Patch this bad boy up, and then we're going to get out of here. Let's Just go, man. Around. Uh, refuel. 200 shit, fucking yeah. dollars? Jesus. Don't get him oh, damn. Fuel in the apocalypse, huh? Fuel in the apocalypse. Okay. Let Let's anything. go. Let's get back. Uh, we'll get back. Let's get to the outpost. Let's clear these motherfuckers out and see what we can do. So I do think we're obviously going to be killing these guys, um, which I do feel kind of bad for. But um, they did shoot at the gate. They're threatening the camp, man. They've got to go. Uh, okay, so we need to go down here. We're going over that crazy-ass bridge. This place is not very well protected, to be honest. Someone could just swim over. And, uh, yeah, we're going to find ourselves in some sh fucking shit trouble, man. Uh, we need some fences. We need some gates. Hey, we need stuff. If the rolls over, we are fucked. Wait, you kidding me? Literally uh, ten great. seconds later. Great, Ricky. I'll, I'll be right there. Oh, God Deacon damn it. Out. Okay. Well, we didn't even get no far. That, that, that's what annoys me about this game a little bit. Uh, you have to kind of like leave the base for them to contact you again. So I guess we're going to go back to Lost Lake. Motherfucker. I just refueled and everything. Ready to go out and take them motherfuckers down. I mean, I could do that if there is time. Um, we're just going to see what Boozer's new arm looks like. Hopefully it's all good. Hopefully he likes it. Um, but yeah, let's go. Let's get over to where we need to be. Crashing this bike into all sorts of fucking people and objects. Let's go. Okay. Right, where the fuck do we go? Okay, I'm guessing by the mechanics or the infirmary. Okay, we're here. Let's go. Boozer, let me see your brand new arm, baby. What does it look like? Is it badass? I hope so. He deserves it. Okay. Crease there. Okay. Got it. Let me secure it in, okay? There you oh, go. that's sick. Okay. Hey, brother. Look what oh. Ricky did. What? Made me a new toy. Oh, I was all deacon. Oh, that's, really, really that's insane. Cool. Hey, uh, I could have been one of those, those yeah. three goddamn musketeers. Hung guard, you <laughs> fucking ripper. <laughs> Pretty cool. Oh, hey. Jesus. Oh. Whoa, whoa. Uh, uh, maybe this wasn't that good of an idea? God damn it. Okay. He's insane. <laughs> Jesus. Okay. Well, I'm glad he likes it, I guess. Okay, Iron Mike's nearly level two trust. Let's go. I'm glad he's happy now. I'm glad he's happy. You just twisted my arm. Okay, I guess we'll do this. Fuck the little job. We've got to drive to a location, really? God damn it. <laughs> There's a lot of to and fro in. Let's go. Drive to a location? It's literally there, but okay. That's what we need to do. Let's go. Okay, we all good? What, what, what was the point? <laughs> what was the actual point? <laughs> Jeez. All right, I'm glad he likes his little um his little knife ado. I like that. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. We could get him like a multi tool so we can like screw like cork screws and stuff. I don't know. I'm, I'm just I'm just brainstorming here. I think it'd be pretty cool. Say John, 
A knife Here. is good for this kind of world, though. Brian. Hold on. Oh, shit. Hi, Brian. Well, Brian, I'm sick of doing your dirty work. You got news for me or not? Yeah, I, I mean, yes, I have news. Well, then what is it? I need you to do one last Oh, come job. on. Will you listen to what I was just saying? I'm done with one this. One more job, then I'll meet you in person, show you what I got. Forget it. Her middle name. Wait, what? It was Irene, right? Sarah, Irene, Whitaker. Shit. It's on her admission form. Okay. One last job. And one last job. I sent you the coordinates. O'Brien out. Damn. Okay, well. Run away. Okay. So he does know her. He knows where she is. He's not coughing up no fucking information, though. Hey, hey. You're headed somewhere in a hurry? Yeah. You remember that Nero bastard I told you about, O'Brien? Well, it looks like he's got some news for me, but I gotta do one last job for him first. Yeah. Okay. You should come with me. Yeah. <laughs> oh, dude. Nah, Chuck down I, that thing, man. Come on. This got me on farm duty. Feeding the world one shitty weed at a time. Fuck, Skiz. I'll drop you off right afterward. When's the last time you saw a helicopter? Come on, buddy. Let's go. I twisted my arm. Never gets old, <laughs> does it? Let's go, Boozman. <laughs> Nice, okay. So we've got the Boozinator coming with us. Let's go. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. This is going to go because he isn't exactly the stealthiest of people. But it might be headed? okay. Over toward Malakwa Lake. You know where that is? Yeah, it's just north of the Rogue Tunnel off uh, Waldo Road. Okay. What are you doing there? The Nero Chopper is going to be on the ground doing whatever the hell it is that they do. O'Brien wants me to see what they're up to. So, Brian, he's, uh, he's what? Your, your shot caller? Handler? No! Jesus, boozer, you know why the hell we're out here. Just asking. Seems like he tells you to jump. You ask how high. It's not how it is. Okay. So we're going over to see one up? last job for O'Brien through. Come on. Uh, it's been worse, you know. I actually don't mind working the farm. Reminds me of when I was a kid. I used to go out to my uncle's farm out at uh, by Adrian on the Idaho border. Spend summers working the beet fields. <laughs> yeah, a little dirt bike I tooled around on. That's where I learned to ride. You're not, when we get to that site, stay close. Whatever happens, don't let them see you. They can get a little trigger happy. Okay, got okay, it. got it. Stay down, keep my mouth shut, don't get us killed. Hey, exactly, thanks for me along, Deke. It's good to get out again. Even riding bitch, you know? <laughs> yeah. I love, I really love Boozer. He's an awesome character. Shit, here okay. they are. Stay close. Right behind you. All right, Boozer on this guy. Jesus. Yeah. Never thought I'd see one of those again. In the air, I mean. All right, now okay. watch. The soldiers come out first. They secure the LZ. And their boy genius... Research not many. Scientist, whatever the hell. He comes out, he looks around. Oh shit, coming this way, Boozman. What? Whatever science shit they're doing out here, how the hell would I know? The one who's been spying on. Okay, wait here. You got it. Okay, this might be a little bit tricky. Squad, check in. Yeah. All good. Clear. Okay. Good here. Shit. Look around. They can't see shit, bro. Perimeter alarm. Okay, now I want him to go over here. Over here, douchebag. I don't know where Boozer is. Easy. Hey, what you got there, Todd? Nice. Really? <laughs> okay, if you must know. Front row seat. We're picking up scat samples. 
Shit. Shed. Yes. Oh god. Freak shit. Yes. <laughs> so we're out here in the middle of nowhere. So you can pick up freak shit. Precisely. <laughs> okay. Enough said. Field note two one zero two. After analysis of scat samples from zones two, three, and four B, there is clear Shit. evidence of Plutonia perfoliata. What's that? Commonly known as miner's lettuce. Please don't interrupt. As well as manicious berries from Juniperus communis. So, why do we care? Okay. Why do we care? Because it means the freaks are eating more than just us and each other. They're eating berries, plants, grass, needles, basically anything a deer would eat. They're omnivores, just like us, but with stomachs that can digest a much wider range of cellulose. Yeah, okay. And what? Okay, we're all good. They're not gonna starve when they run out of us to eat. The freaks aren't going away anytime soon. Shit. Shit. That's bad. Yeah, that's bad. I'm done here. Okay. Uh, head back to the bike. Alright, we need to go back to the bike. To be careful. I guess the back ends are probably the safest. What I'm gonna do. We're gonna go all the way around, just so these little motherfuckers don't see me. Sounds like a plan to me. This guy. I don't think they're gonna catch me now. Okay, we're all good. Let's go, Bozeman. Did you see all that shit? That was fucking insane, man. He's just standing out here with his big ass knife. <laughs> okay. You catch any of that over my radio? That's pretty fucked up. Good taxpayer money, and they're out here collecting freaker shit. Yeah, I told you. Who knows what they're doing or why? Oh, they gotta have a base around here somewhere, right? You try following them? Yeah, but they always disappear over the mountains heading south, and with the highway choked off, I can never get close. Sons of bitches. Seems like they got a lot to answer for. Damn right, man. You're damn right. Okay. So what are we doing now? What are we doing? Where are we headed now? It's a good question. Oh, I'm sorry, Brian. Brian okay. There? Come in, O'Brien. I'm here. Finished. Yeah, it's done. Where am I meeting you? I wasn't expecting you so soon. I'm sending you the coordinates now, but it might take okay, a to get there. O'Brien out. What the Alrighty. hell do you think I've been doing out here? Hey, you're right about one thing. It does sound like an asshole. <laughs> does Boozer like anyone? I don't think he does. <laughs> uh, like, at all. <laughs> okay, we are here, man. Oh, that is good. Hi, Brian. Right here. I don't want him getting skittish because I brought someone along. Yeah, I'll keep an eye on the bike. I've seen enough Nero assholes for one day. Oh, really? We gotta walk all okay, that distance? Back. Come on. He knew her middle name, Irene. She can't be alive. But he's alive. Why not her? Huh? Okay. So Boozer is gonna watch the bike, and I guess we're gonna be going over to O'Brien to find out. The name and location. There he is. Not the name, but the location oh, of our wife. Gotta stop doing that. What you got? Alright, look. I'm gonna lay it out for you, but it's not good news. I finally found a guy who was willing to do some digging through some files that, we, that they used to keep while they still kept records. Okay, no problem. Anyway, Sarah Whitaker, your wife, was admitted to the Camp Mash unit on the South Flats outside of Silver Lake. Uh, according to the records, she was in surgery for six hours and then was moved okay, to... So she survived. The stab wound, she survived. Yeah, uh, yeah. According to the records, she made a full recovery. And then she was moved to another camp on the outskirts okay, of the Okay, so... So she could still be alive. Even after all this time, she could still be alive, you're saying? No. What? What do you mean, no? It was overrun. No! Everything was overrun. There were no survivors. You survived. They survived. Look, 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 there was nothing that would have protected that camp, okay? Highway 97 w w is an artery. Infected 
freaks poured up from L.A., from the Bay Area, from Sacramento. There were thousands and thousands and thousands of them. There was, there was nothing we could do. I get it. So you bugged out. Who did you bring with you? Uh, Nero personnel. Some feds. People with clearance. Nero personnel? The soldiers? The guys with the guns? The guys who should have been protecting no, no, the there, civilians? There's nothing that you can do against the horde. Oh, They're no, too strong. I know all They're too about fast. hordes. Well, they right. knew that there was nothing that we could do. Oh, you know what you could have done? You could have brought a few of them with you. You could have saved a few lives. But there was no hope, there was no time, there was no room, okay? We'd already turned on each other by the time the hordes arrived. No, I get it. Damn, bro. Look, I'm sorry about your wife. I'm sorry about all of this. But you gotta understand. If you hadn't sent her with me that night, she would have been dead the next morning. You did the right thing. <laughs> you know, if you had decided to stay, the only thing that would have happened is you'd be dead right alongside her. Don't you think I know that? <laughs> O'Brien. Thank you for saving her life that night. Damn. That was fucked, man. Alright, guys, I'm going to end today's video here. Thank you so damn much for watching. If you have enjoyed today's video, smash that like button, comment to subscribe, and I will see you for more days gone next time. So, tell some guys, have an amazing day, and I will see you all again in the next video.